back here at home. Short-term rental properties like Airbnb and, and Verbos have many cities in North Texas redefining where they should go. Yeah, our biggest cities such as Dallas, Fort Worth, Arlington have all tried to tackle this hot topic as some residents have expressed concerns over safety, noise, and even trash. Our Nick Starling has covered uh, this issue uh, with many of our communities and happening tonight in Louisville is the next one to take it on. Mm -hmm. Nick, uh, what can you tell us about what's going on there? Hey, good morning, guys. We're outside Louisville City Hall, where city council members will actually hear from the public later this evening on the best way to go about these short-term rental properties. As you guys mentioned, this is something that many communities in North Texas have tackled, and Louisville will hear from the public later on tonight. And when you're driving around this community, you'll see many of these signs reading, Homes, Not Hotels, or Short-Term Rentals Destroy Neighborhoods. I spoke with some residents who want their political leaders to take this issue on and create zoning regulations to keep STRs out of single family neighborhoods because they say there's safety concerns, parking issues, property values can decline, and sometimes in these bigger houses, there can be more than a dozen people showing up. Well, the biggest issue is that they're used for parties, that the people who come there, and it could be four or five hundred different people a year, don't live in the community. They often are, you know, enticed there by. Look at the big house. Look at the big pool. So according to the city, there are 93 STRs in Louisville, and they saw an 86% increase in listings from the year 2020 to 2023. Now, in the past year, there have been 16 calls for service at 11 of the properties. One STR operator we spoke with says he doesn't allow parties at the home, and this is a way to earn revenue. It's a creative option that I've had to utilize because of financial difficulties. So if you want your voice heard in this STR debate, you are invited to come out here to Louisville City Hall. The meeting starts at 530 later on this evening. Then city staff will come up with some options that city council members will vote on later on this year. Live in Louisville, Nick Starling, CBS News, Texas.